Hello people, this is Self Tuts and we are continuing our series on understanding the concept of Express.js. In the last video, we have seen what is request object and how to access different parameters of request object. In this video, we will see how to send data in our query params and how to access it. So basically, you can send data in your HTTP request in different ways. Like you can send it inside your body. You can send it inside your query parameters. You can send it inside your headers. You can send it inside your resource parameter. In this video, we are interested in sending parameter in query and extracting those parameters. So suppose our request that we are using in the previous videos was something like this. That is HTTP localhost 3000 and the user. So this localhost 3000 is the HTTP server and the user is the resource that we are trying to access or user is a route or endpoint that we are trying to access now suppose we want to send some data through it with this request like we want to find the user for a particular location we want to find the user for a particular age so how to do that so one of the way of sending your data through in your express http request is by using this query parameters so how to write a query parameter so you need to provide a question mark and then in with the question mark you need to follow your query parameter. So the first word is the key and the second one is the value. So here what we are sending, we are sending the query parameter key as location and the value as India. Now suppose you want to send multiple query parameters, so how to send that? So you can send multiple parameters by using the ampersand sign. So here after the question mark, there is a this one is the key that is location which has a value of India and then the age is there which is having a value of 25. So what does this mean that we want to find the user whose location is in India and the age is 25. So there can be a business logic of searching it any other way or you can use this data in some other sense but I am trying to explain you that how to send this query parameter in express HTTP request. So this is the simple way through which you can uh, add multiple query parameter using the ampersand sign and you can send that to the express HTTP request. Now the question arises that how to access this query parameter values like what the key and the value so it is a very simple thing to access and uh, if you need to access it you just need to write request.query in your express route handler so we'll see it that how to access it so i'm inside my app that we are go that we are building during this code that is express app the files are there we have left here only previously app.js was there so i'll open my vim and inside my vim there is this app.js file i'll open it and if you remember then this is the last point where we left that we were uh, learning about the request object so i'll delete it now now what i'll do i'll do a uh, variable query parameters equal to query parameter equal to request dot query so this is the way that we can this is the request object that is automatically injected inside my get route uh, which is a property of uh, express itself so you need not to worry about this and this is the request object of express and this is the response object of express so what we need to do we need to send this parameter to our as a response in json format so i have saved this file so you can see this is my query parameter and i am accessing it through request.query now we'll uh, start this server and we'll uh, try to send a request to the client for this route and we'll see what the query parameter is written so i'll open a new window here and i'll say first you need to check the ip address of your uh, system then you can send the request to that since i am using a vagrant box which is a virtual machine so it has its own ip so and i am inside my linux box so checking ip in linux box is very easy you need to type if config so you can see that my private ip is this that is 172.18.0.100 so what i'll do i'll start this server by running node app.js so the server has successfully started now to send the request we'll use a, a plugin of chrome that is postman which is the most famous plugin to send request and we can uh, you can download the postman 
inside your chrome post by going searching for postman chrome and it will uh, take you to the post uh, chrome web store from where you can download plugins and here you can see the plugin and you can download it okay so the chrome web store has opened and since i have already downloaded it so it is saying me launch the app so you can download it from here now i'll just launch it that i'm starting it so this is the best tool if you want to send a request to a http server or any other thing so what i'll do i'll close my previous request that i have sent and now what i need to do my route is what my route is get route so this is a get so what i'll do my request type is get and then i'll try my uh, type my request url so it is what 172.18.0.100 and then user so user is there and there is nothing else so i'll send it and you can see okay and the port is 3000 on which my server is running so i have to type the full address of the server and i have sent it so this you can see the response that has come is an empty json object since i have not sent any query parameter now what i need to send i want to send location equal to india so i have sent the location i'll try to send it you can see the location is now coming here location equal to india and then what i'll say age equal to 25 so I've written the age equal to 25 and then I'll send it. So you can see this object that is query parameters object contains two things that is location and age with the value India and 25. I can also show you that we can just console log it here. So if you need to access only the age, so you can say console.log query parameter dot age and what it will do, it will write on my server. So what I'll exit this one and then this is my server so i need to restart it because i have done some changes here this is node app.js and again i'll try to send a request from postman and this time you can see what it is there console is not defined so i think i have misspelled it c o n s o l e okay i need to type console.log i need to restart the server so i'll go to my postman and this time again i'll send a request this time you can see the in my full response it is coming location and age because what i have done i have sent whole query parameter but in, on my server i have logged this console.log query parameter dot age so you can see the value 25 has come here so this is the way through which you can send data in your request by using query parameter so it was very easy to send data and to access data so this was all about query parameter in express http request if you like my channel please subscribe to it and if you like this video please give a thumbs up